do you have a two leg relay and you want to turn it into a three leg so the way you can have the clicking noise and everything in, in all cars so the way you can connect all your led lights i'm going to show you step by step how you can do this turn a two leg a relay or pin a, how some people said you know relay into a three so i'm going to show you uh, how you can do that and also why you should do uh, that for instance in this case i have a camaro as you can see this is a camaro a 98 i've been replacing the led light here here in uh, here as well so the problem that i'm having with the turning uh, signals is if you use this this costs maybe like 10 20 dollars uh, tops uh, the bad thing about this is uh, you're, you're not going to hear the the clicking noise so if you don't hear the clicking noise sometimes I, i'm driving and i don't hear it and then i forgot you know the blinking uh, light or the turning light you know on uh, for more than i should so by having the the relay uh, i will be able to to fix uh, this so as you can see here i have uh, this one uh, this one is is great as you can see this one uh, works for led uh, lights as well and uh, we are going to uh, use uh, this one because i like it a lot i, tr I tried i did this for another vehicle and it works uh, great so here you have a potentiometer the good thing about this is that you can control the the blinking uh, uh, speed so basically if you want to blink click 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 or you want click 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 or something in in between uh you can uh, control it uh, with this and also you're going to have the clicking noise so there are uh, several options uh, one you can leave the original one so let's say that if you if you want to use the regular uh, relay the basic one you can leave it the way it is and you you will have to add the resistor to each a light bulb but uh, you know you know you're not going to have the benefit of led light that is going to pull less uh, power or uh, you can use uh, you can do this uh, option that i'm giving you uh, right now that to me that will be the best option so uh, because i couldn't find anywhere a uh, relay uh, like that but um, with a click noise you know with the relay or, or the noise inside so i uh, the only option uh, that i was able to find is with three legs so that is why i'm showing you how to convert this into this so that way if you connect this you're going to have the potentiometer here on the top you're going to have the click no noise and uh, everything will work like you know almost like from factory here in this one as usual uh, you can see uh, the um, the potentiometer here uh, you can uh, you know regulate that but uh, you're not going to have the clicking noise so that is a good uh, thing or bad thing so as usual i am, I am in us if you need tools electronics so let me know i can ship it to you worldwide otherwise i'll leave you the link and you can buy it yourself so here uh, i'll show you what uh, you have to pay attention so you see the the b the b here that you see is battery uh, so and here uh, where it says uh, where you see the l le l is the load so basically we're going to use these two because at least in this card that is what you have here uh, the only thing is in the three pin uh, relay or three legs or prone or however you want to call it um, is is inverse so it's not uh, the way you see it uh, with the with the other one at least in, in my case so as you can see here we have the the plus sign and uh, here we have the l the l sign the the one that you see here in the in the middle this one is the l here we have the load and here we have the battery uh, and here we have the negative so we will have to connect the negative otherwise this is not going to work and i'm going to connect it so that way you know that it works so basically uh, because the order is inverse so that is why i did a uh, uh, this I, I did this extension so if you want to do this extension uh, you can do this so that way you don't have to modify this because otherwise you, at least in my case i had to cut it in the middle so that way i can you know rotate the the polarity of this and this will work so by doing this i think it's better and that's it, it will be easier um you're going to hook up the battery and the load in this uh, two accordingly and uh, this is the ground so here is the negative and you are going to hook it up uh, here so by doing this it will work so i'm going to do it and i'm going to show you so that way you can see that it works all right i was able to hook up everything so as you can see here you have this and this and 
Uh, here you have the third leg that goes uh, there uh, to the chassis. So I, I hook up everything the way I told you. And now I'm going to show you so that way you can see how it works. I'm going to put the blinkers. And as you can see, it works. And you hear the clicking noise. And here you have the potentiometer, just in case, if you want to change the blinking speed. So now it's like crazy. Blinking so fast, or I can make it go slower. There we go. That's it. So I hopefully you have enjoyed this class. If you want to learn more, go to my playlist. You will see all my classes about different topics. Thank you for watching and see you next time.